Hola clase, me llamo Carl. Mi examinino número dos uh, consists of uh, module número dos, uh, the Mexican American culture or the Hispanic culture in America, which is uh, estudiantes Americans from the United States, uh, and how they uh, influence um, the rest of uh, Latin America. Um, here in America, we have um, things that we celebrate with the Latin culture, uh, Dia de los, de los Muertos, uh, Day of the Dead, and uh, other things of that nature. Um, you know, um, it's uh, Hispanic culture has greatly influenced um, America uh, with their um, their como como se dice uh, comida and uh, diete diete diet um, for here. Uh, we celebrate things like uh, um, Taco uh, Tuesday, Mirtes. Um, and we also have uh, Comunidades Hispanicas, or Hispanas, Comunidades Hispanas, uh, the Hispanic community, um, which is, you know, largely influenced. Um, uh, the by biculturalidad, um, the biculturality of the Hispanics and Americans, uh, or the Hispanos from the United States, um, which uh, Hispano America is influenza mucho. Uh, mucho uh, Latinos and Latinas, Latino and Latinas, to celebrate their heritage and their culture. Um, like I said, uh, Day of the Dead is uh, one of the one of the things that really is uh, celebrated here. That I know my family actually um, celebrates, and uh, we uh, we have fun. Um, you know, celebrating our lost ones. Um, the Hispanic culture is very, um, they're very argulosa, argulosa, proud people, uh, simpatico, they're very, um, very nice and, um, sociable, they're very sociable and, um, uh, tra trabajo, very hardworking um, individuals who love their culture, love their family, um, you know, and uh, they they value um, you know hard work and uh, and other things. Um, some things that uh, they do value and share is is food you know burritos un, uh, uh, ap apres, uh, and uh, tacos love tacos oh man tamales um, but also like uh, quesadillas mole um, and maracasos seafood um, they love their food um, yeah, it's, uh, it's this, this section was, um, was mainly talking about, uh, Hispanic Americans and the way they, the way they do things and also their, um, their culture. And I know one part of it was, uh, the murals of, um, of the Hispanic culture and uh, one city or one one well one city in our county in Santa Barbara that has this was uh, is Lompoc. They have a whole section uh, off ocean of um, 
murals that people have painted talking about the cultural uh, heritage and um, and the way Lompoc was created and it's uh, it's something really neat and uh, let me see if I can pull up a picture here uh, it's just it's something that people um, people really like and uh, they flock to and you know they just they do things like this oh, if you can, there you go they have all kinds of neat things and it's rich in their heritage and they do things like memorial and everything like that um, and also they have uh, uh, Azteca uh, colors the colors called Azteca uh, which are it's very neat and very breathtaking to behold um, they do take pride in their community the Hispano Americanos um, and and what they do um, Mi Encantada Lompoc's uh, uh, mural area dependent uh, de on the day you go sometimes there's festivals and things like that um, that you can really take part of and um, and just immerse yourself um, todo tipo uh, el, um, uh, el, el personas uh, yeah, um, all kinds of people that are there um, uh, it's just, it's really neat. It's really neat to see. Um, I, I thoroughly enjoy it. Um, they do have uh, celebrations uh, con el celebrar, uh the contru, contru, con, con, contributions um, of hardworking people. Um, the Racias of Lompoc, the roots, um, is what they're they're generally celebrating during some of these festivals, um, which is not is not too often. But um, working there, it's it's kind of cool um, to see. Uh, you know, uh, also in this section, we learn about a family. Um, uh, madre, un papa, uh, mijo, mija, uh, and then we also learn gender with that. Uh, uh, niño, nin, niño is a boy, my son, and niña is, uh, or niño is a boy, niña is a girl, mijo, o is a son, mija is the daughter. <coughs> And madre is mom, and padre is father. And we learned how the family um, comes together as as a unit, and how to separate the um, the masculine from feminine to figure out um, mother and father without there being an O or an A at the end. Um, so. I pretty much think I've covered as much as I really can remember off the top of my head. Um, the Mexicano people, like I said again, they're just they're hardworking people. They're they're really culturally engaged and charged, and they take really a big sense of pride in what they do. Um, and their ethnina, ethnicity, um, not just uh, immigrantes, but Latinos of natural birth from, you know, America. And as a raza, they are a, a strong, strong people um, and a strong cultural background. Again, um, uh, yeah, uh, so... 
uh, uno más tiempo, mi amo Carl, muchas gracias por escuchar. Um, buenas noches and uh, have a good weekend.